times, you already know who it is. The one and only homie chef, aka Wings912 on IG. That's W I N G Z Z912 on Instagram. If you're looking at me, it's Almighty Shoe Review. Shout out to the trap. You already know that's the squad that backs me. You know what I mean? Making the boys in Boston all the way up and down the East Coast. We kill shit. If you're interested in joining, link in the description. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate y'all tapping in with me. Likes, you know what I mean? Notification bell, subscriptions. Always dope to stay in that rotation. Please keep up that energy. You know what I'm saying? Any information that you need is below in the description. You can follow me on IG, follow the trap on IG, whole Nina. You know what I'm saying? Today's shoe is an SB Dunk, and I want to look at this shoe because it's a pretty much it's different than most. You know what I'm saying? And it has some quality, so I'm just not even gonna waste no time. I'm just gonna go ahead and get into it. Aha, you already know. They always be switching up the box, you know what I'm saying? You know, but nevertheless, colors read Gorge Green, Gorge Green Black. Present to you none other than the Nike SB Dunk Pro High Decon. And yeah, I'm gonna speak on them. I really like these shoes. It's a lot going on with them. Now that we got him in hand, let's get into him. Alright, so everybody knows I love my SB Dunk highs, and this is pretty dope. Very, very clean shoe, very good execution. It has good suede on it, you know what I'm saying? all green but the uh around the toe box and in the heel it's a little bit longer for the skating purposes you know what i'm saying very very good uh there's a couple deep distinct details but we're gonna get into that until in a second uh it has no alternate laces um it has that nike grind rubber sole which is you know that kind of combination of different things so you can see the green in there you can see the cream and you can see that that khaki bottom you know what i mean it has air zoom technology in it but when you look at the tongue, the first thing you can see is that still off-white deconstructed feel. And that's where the decon comes in for this shoe, you know what I'm saying? Um, now, normally, everybody knows SB Dunks have the extra padding just for extra comfort. And you keep it comfortable and keep it easy. But with these, they went a different route and they deconstructed it. So they did more than just deconstruct the normal parts of the shoe. They really broke it down and left a lot of the padding out. Now, I don't, I left my highs, but today, I had on some SB Dunks and I had on my Ray Guns, you know what I mean? And as you can see with the Ray Guns, the tongue is fat, but you can also see it's just fatter around the ankle area and around the heel. Just, you know what I mean, give you a little bit more comfort just in case, you know, rolling your ankle, so on and so forth. But when it comes to these, bare bone, you know what I'm saying? You see the tongue is already deconstructed, you can see the exposed parts, but for the most part for the most part for the rest of the shoe it doesn't have that same comfort and that same padding so if you skate these it's good but i feel like you know that pro is really important you know what i mean you got to be a pro what you do to skate these now me personally building a board to be a cruiser my ankles ain't got it no more so doing kick flips and all them board flips is just not in it for me you know what i mean however i still think it's gonna be dope to cruise so I'm building a board, you know what I mean? Getting involved, but these shoes are definitely amazing and I love them and I love the way they look and I love the feel, I love the textures, the whole nine, the execution, you know what I mean? But if you skate with these, you just gotta be dope at what you do, man. So one more look at them. You know what I'm saying? Uh, when it comes to, you know, the chefs, uh, I'm, I'm giving these an eight. I'm gonna give these an eight. Now there's two reasons why. I love green and I love the execution and the quality of the materials used in these, you know what I'm saying? Very top notch, you know what I mean? Not skatable, you know what I'm saying? So that kind of takes it down a bit, but I just love the color. I love the feel of it. And you know what I mean? It's just the quality. And then not only that, but I really like Jordan 1's. I'm a fan of Jordan 1's and SB Dunks and Jordan 1's pretty much go hand in hand. It's like the same shoe almost. And you know, there's a little bit of tweaks and differences, but for the most part, this is what's giving me that good feel. And I like this. I feel like this color is gonna do good 
in the winter if you're going rock fits with it it'll do good in the winter and it's definitely going to do great in the summer when that khaki comes out and you know you got the shorts and everything so get in the comments let me know did y'all get these did y'all know these existed you know what i mean how do you feel about them resale wise because of the plainness you know it ain't really doing too much but who cares about resale like you know what i mean sb dumps are always for the toe so get down in the comments let me know how you feel man um appreciate y'all tapping in though you already know what it is you know the model wash your hands wash your ass wear your mask you know what i mean keep yourself safe so you can keep your loved ones safe in this holiday season because you know traveling germs you already know how it go man by any means keep them sneakers clean Jordan 2 is December 30th, man. I promise to God I will take all donations of dirty kicks to flip on eBay. That's the clue. Stay, tap stay tapped in. I'll let you. <laughs>